We're talking about invertebrates, animals with no spines. So many invertebrates, there are so many kinds. Let's start with Nideria. They are so squishy. Jellyfish and the corals that are home to all the fishies. They might try to sting you, but they are not to blame. Jellyfish can't be mean. They've got practically no brains. Arthropods are super neat. They have the most complex eyes and hard exoskeletons to protect their insides. But these hard parts can't grow, and so they have to molt. Striated muscles allow them to quickly bolt. Heck, yeah, invertebrates. Animals with no spines. How many invertebrates? At least 45 different phyla. kind. Polychaetes are the ocean worms. They're a little creepy, but I don't mind. Octopus are mollusks and they're, they're pretty smart. Clams and snails and nudibranchs make their soft-bodied counterparts. Echinoderms are my favorite. They're entirely marine. They've got pentaradial symmetry. They don't have any muscles. They have to use the water. And if they lose a limb, well, hey, it kind of don't matter. Oh my god, invertebrates, they really are the best. If you give them a chance, they'll stand up to the test. They're the coolest animals on the planet. So go tell your friends about those good old inverts.